Tighten those up. The MK-19, also referred to as the Mark 19, is a potent weapon produced by Seiko Defense Industries since 1968, with an approximate cost of $20,000. It has found service in nearly 30 countries, and more than 35,000 units of this weapon have been manufactured to date. The United States initiated the development of the MK-19 during the Vietnam War to meet the need for a high-powered river patrol craft. The original Mod Zero version was conceptualized in 1966 and was quickly put into service in 1968. An enhanced model, the Mod 1, became operational around 1971. In 1974, the US Navy attempted to enhance the design with the Mod 2, although the Mod 2 was never adopted. In 1976, the US Navy simplified the weapon, leading to the creation of the Mod 3, which became the primary MK-19 model. In 1983, the MK-19 Mod 3 was also adopted by the U.S. Army. The MK-19 is an air-cooled, blowback-operated weapon that operates on an open bolt system, offering the option for fully automatic or single-shot firing. It utilizes 40mm grenades, including high-explosive fragmentation, dual-purpose armor-piercing or fragmentation, and smoke grenades. The MK-19 is fed by 32 or 48 round disintegrating link belts, with weights of 19 or 27 kilograms. It is capable of firing at a rate of 60 rounds per minute for rapid fire or 40 rounds per minute for sustained fire. However, it is not safe to be fired at targets within 75 meters of the weapon. For aiming, it employs a large rear leaf sight that can be adjusted in 100 meter increments. Additionally, a night vision sight can be attached via a picate knee rail. Despite having a flash suppressor designed to preserve the gunner's night vision, it produces a highly visible flash. Due to its relatively low recoil, the MK-19 is best suited for use on vehicles or small vessels. It can be mounted on a tripod, although it is more commonly employed in vehicle configurations, serving on various platforms such as high-mobility, multipurpose wheeled vehicles, assault amphibious vehicles, the Striker, Empire Apis, Hovercraft, Jeeps, and ships. Oh my God! The MK-19's formidable power is primarily attributed to the use of M400 and 3040X53M high-explosive dual-purpose grenades. These grenades can penetrate up to 50 millimeters of rolled homogeneous armor with a direct hit making it effective against most armored personnel carriers, Good. certain infantry fighting vehicles, infantry, and even helicopters. It is lethal within a 5-meter radius and can cause injuries within 15 meters. The MK-19 has seen action in numerous conflicts, primarily with all branches of the U.S. Armed Forces, including the Vietnam War, Persian Gulf War, War in Afghanistan, Arab War, 2006 Lebanon War, Turkey PKK conflict, and the Mexican Drug War. The Soviet Union adopted a similar 30mm automatic grenade launcher shortly after the United States did, known as the AGS-17 Plamia. Heckler and Koch developed an improved and lighter version of the MiG-19 using the same caliber, known as the GMG, shortly for grenade machine gun. This variant is highly reliable and accurate, utilizing a closed bolt system. Prominent operators of the MK-19 include the United States, Mexico, Pakistan, Canada, Israel, and Greece. Turkey and Egypt have licensed the production of the MK-19, with Israel having done so in the past.